This is a Made Simple Learning video tutorial. Visit our site for hundreds more videos. Let's see how to backup and restore our BlackBerry device using BlackBerry desktop software. Most of us have a lot of important and or personal information on our Blackberries. We want to make sure we don't lose it if the BlackBerry gets lost or stolen or damaged. That's why you back up your BlackBerry. And the nice thing about desktop software is you can back it up automatically. You first have to connect your BlackBerry using the USB cable to your computer. Notice my bold 9700 is connected because I have the USB icon showing here next to the name. Go ahead and connect your BlackBerry to your computer. And then once you've done it, click on Device. And let's go down here to look at Device Options. In the Device Options screen, there's two areas we want to look at, the General tab and the Backup tab. In the General tab, you can see when you connect your device, you can automatically back up your BlackBerry. I recommend checking that. And then depending on your preferences, go ahead and back up daily, weekly, bi-monthly, or monthly. So weekly is usually pretty good unless you do a lot of changes on your BlackBerry every day. The other thing you want to look at in Device Options is the Backup tab. In the Backup, you can tell BlackBerry Desktop Software to skip any confirmations on the automatic backup. That means it won't ask you, hey, I'm about to automatically back up your BlackBerry. Is that OK? So if you check that box, it will not ask you. And manual backups, it will ask you because that's not checked. And then your preferred backup settings. There's three options here. Full, that means absolutely everything, including all email. Quick, that means everything except for your email. And then custom. If you click on custom here, you can actually select specific types of data to back up. So let's leave it on full. And the other thing that's very important is where is that backup file stored? Right now on my computer, and by default, it's stored in Documents, BlackBerry, Backup. One thing to really think about when you back up your BlackBerry is I've had this issue happen to me. When I backed up my BlackBerry, I backed it up onto my PC or my laptop. And what happened is the laptop hard disk crashed and I lost my BlackBerry backup. So when you back up your BlackBerry, it makes a lot of sense to put it on an external hard disk or another device to back it up just in case your main computer crashes. That way you've got a nice backup of your BlackBerry data. Now this checkbox down here, Encrypt Backup File, if you check that, it will actually secure your backup and allow you to attach a password to it for additional security. When you're done with your settings, go down to the bottom of the screen here and click OK. OK, that's it for the options related to backing up and restoring your BlackBerry. Now, how do we get that done? You see there's a big button right here, and we could just click that. So let's go ahead and click Backup Now. And again, we've got those three options, which we described earlier. I'll leave it on full, because I like to make sure everything's backed up. And then it gives you the backup file name. Each time you back it up, it will continue to add a number to this file name. And if you want to encrypt your file, here's where you put your password. And we'll leave that alone for now. And then if you don't want to be asked these settings again, check this box here. And now let's click Backup. And it warns you not to disconnect your BlackBerry. And it may take a few minutes, depending on how much you have on your BlackBerry. And you'll notice down here, it does give you a reminder of where the file is being copied to on your computer. And as we said before, you might want to take that file and throw it on a USB flash drive or an external hard disk just to keep it for safekeeping in case your hard disk crashes on your main computer. And finally, when your backup's complete, you'll see a window like this telling you it's done, telling you where it's stored, and then if you don't want to see this again, go ahead and check that box there. I do like to see that it's been successfully done, so I leave that unchecked and click Close. So that's how to back up your BlackBerry. Now how do you restore your BlackBerry? You click on Device up here in the upper left corner and you go to Restore and then it actually shows you the different files. I backed it up yesterday and then I backed it up here just a few minutes ago. So we can pick out the backup file we want to use. And notice the backup file folder is the one we talked about before. If your backups are stored somewhere else, say on a USB drive, you'd want to go ahead and click Change Folder and go locate where your most current backup is. And then select the device data to restore. You could select All Device Data and Settings or 
selected device data and settings. So here you'll be able to restore things like just the address book or calendar or other items if you'd like. So let's leave it on all device and then you click restore here and the warning shown to you that everything will be replaced so go ahead and click yes and now it's restoring all the data to your BlackBerry. Now since I had a, a lot of email on my device this restore process has taken about 30 minutes. So depending on how much you've got on your BlackBerry be ready for a fairly lengthy restore process if you're restoring your BlackBerry. And finally when the restore is done you'll see a message just like this one here and if you don't want to see this message again as we said before check that box there and then click close. So I'll get, click close and so that's how to back up and restore. One last thing you can do from the device menu is to delete all your data. You can actually delete all your data the default here. Say you're giving your BlackBerry away, selling it, or returning it for service. You'd want to delete all your data after you backed it up. You could also click here and delete selected data. For instance, if you wanted to get rid of your address book, if you're having troubles with syncing or other things like that, you could do that. And if you scroll down the list here, you'll notice that you can delete pretty much everything from your browser bookmarks to your memo pad, calendar, just about anything else. And you've got the option here to back up before deleting, and it will show you the backup file. And again, you could password protect that. Then you'd click delete to do the deletion. So that's it for backup, restore, and delete using BlackBerry desktop software. Thanks for watching and listening.